important thing that we've learned is discrimination. It's very sad because people are just being treated differently just because of their skin color or the way they act or what their just what their religion is and people and it's very sad to watch I mean like and I am like we're telling adults this to show them how sad it is and now like if that could be them we can't do this because it's just very hurtful and that's children and that we're telling adults this it just feels really good to you know share something and do something that like adults you know really don't do as much um yeah um so like like you should really tell people to stop this discrimination because it can really affect our lives like as they say sticks and stones may break my bones but words can never hurt me well sometimes those words can hurt you there's different kinds of discriminations like stereotype actually once i got stereotyped because of my height um, this second grader told me I wasn't supposed to be there because he thought I was a preschooler. And like when I was in preschool, kids kept bullying me and saying, "Pick on me," saying like, "Why you you must have flunked because you're very tall." It's like, no, I'm not. I keep telling them, "No, I'm not," and "No, I'm not," because it's just like my family. It's like we're very tall because we like to eat healthy. We love vegetables, and it's just like just. It's just like really bad. What have you learned about how to make the world a better place? Okay, thank you. Um, well, what I've learned, what I've learned to make it better, like, is to like go, like, follow your dreams and encourage people to do that too. Not just yourself. Just go and encourage them to go follow your dreams. And like what you could, and like what I've learned to make the world a better place is to cheer people up and lift them up when they're down. Don't just leave them sitting there and just all sad and depressed. Always go up to them and say, "Hey, you want to come hang out with me?" Or just like and put up poster and put up posters and stuff saying that like, "Don't do this because this is very sad." Or no smoking. Yeah. This is something I worked on earlier. Yeah, and like no, and like things like you can't do this because it's just like not fair and like put things up saying like stop the hatred stop the bullying things like that it's just like very very sad yes. and a lot of our examples are around the classroom did did you learn a lot this year in aces prep yes we did we have learned so many topics like animal discrimination, per, per, people discrimination, we've learned about corals, we've learned about the ocean, we've learned about animals being beat and killed and skinned alive. There were it was like it's not good to eat the chicken that comes from that comes from the factories that are that they're being slaughtered and killed in a very disturbing way. It's like people are like punching and beating pigs and hitting them and like the chickens are like hanging half dead and they're just stacked on top of each other and you can get a lot of more information from our teacher Ms. Ramos and it's in the from the rest of our classroom and um actually um uh, like it's it's always been a thing in my family to like if we find animals hurt or beat up like we'll kind of like take them in like we'll like we'll like keep them for a day shelter them give them food I want to go to Cal State Long Beach. I want to go to UCLA. Go UCLA. Go Cal State Long Beach. Go.